Okay, Google. Galaxy Note 2 KitKat ROM. Hi, folks. Back from Galaxy Note 2 root.com, and uh, I just want to show you one of the cool features about KitKat. I've got it running on my T Mobile Galaxy Note 2. Um, this is Omni ROM, and uh, this is running the latest uh, Android 4.4. It is built on the latest uh, 4.4 sources from Google, and uh, I've actually got the T0 LTE version, which means you can install this on AT&T T-Mobile, uh, GTN 7105, and Canadian Galaxy Note 2. And it is also available uh, for the GTN 7100. Um, so you can install it, AT&T T-Mobile, uh, Canadian, GTN 7105, GTN 7100 Note 2s. Um, off the bat, of course, you got the OK Google, uh, the Hangouts. Now you do have an option to uh, set SMS to be integrated with your SMS. Um, so instead of going to your message box, it will go to your Hangouts. Uh, also with this ROM, um, you do also get DSP Manager, sort of like Cyanogen Mod uh, ROMs. So that is nice to tweak your sound. As for Super SU, you will have to actually install Super SU a zip file. Um, so don't forget that when you install the ROM. And also when you install the ROM, make sure you have the latest version of Clockwork Mod Recovery. You can get the latest version of ROM Manager before you install the ROM. Uh, update it to the latest Clockwork Mod. Uh, Clockwork Mod Recovery for your Note 2, whether you have AT&T T-Mobile, um, GTN 7100, make sure you update your Clockwork Mod Recovery and install. If you don't, you'll end up in a boot loop and you'll be crying. I don't want you guys to end up crying. And uh, one surprising news, uh, Android 4, with Android 4.4 KitKat, Wallet works out of the box. As you can see, my wallet is working on my T-Mobile Note 2. It should also work on AT&T Canadian, GTN 7105, um, GTN 7100. Um, so that's kind of, you know, I think Google has actually uh, loosened the security on the wallet, and I don't see why it should not work on every Android device. So now it is working, uh, and there are a lot of um, new addition like Quick Office and new, um, new photo editor and gallery. A bunch of new stuff. If you want to see some of the top 10 features of KitKat, what it brings, and you haven't seen my video, definitely check that out. I'll have that on my site and also uh, the whole installation directions on my site. So definitely follow that. Um, definitely you don't end up in a boo. Now, one thing that's not working with this ROM, um, which is going to be bummer, I mean, everything works out of the box data, Wi Fi, Bluetooth, uh, except for the camera. I even tried installing 4.3 Photosphere camera cannot connect to the camera. Um, so that's something being worked on and just because this is a beta ROM, that's why camera is not working. Uh, but uh, make sure you know you know that before you install the ROM. And also if you're you know you can always back up your current ROM in Cloud Mod Recovery and then install the ROM. And if you don't like it, just restore your uh, current ROM, whatever you're running right now. Then you can simply try it out for a couple days, uh, revert back, just don't use your camera for a couple days while you try out KitKat. Um, otherwise, it is near flawless. Um, the, the browsing experience is pretty darn good. Uh, it is very, very smooth, as you can see here. Everything is running uh, super smooth. I mean, you can kind of tell it is definitely a KitKat. Um, and also, you can tell it's an authentic KitKat. Uh, let me show you how to do that for those of you new to KitKat. Um, go to Settings, About Phone, um, go to Android uh, version 4.4. Hitting it a bunch of times. If you see K, hold it down. Uh, if you see Android, hold it down. Um, hold it down again. Hold it down again. And you will be able to get to the Easter eggs here. If you see this, this is an authentic Android 4.4 built on Google sources. Uh, anyway, I just want to show you that. Anyway, definitely check it out if you have AT&T Mobile, GTN 7105, GTN 7100, Canadian Galaxy at Note 2. I'll definitely try it out. Try it out. I'm just so excited. And uh, just know the camera is not working, and some of you may never use the camera, then you can use it as a daily driver even. Um, but uh, looking pretty good actually for the first release, or first beta build, um, this is looking really good. So definitely try it out for this weekend, this week, whenever you have free time, and do let me know what you think. And uh, yeah, that's about it. And as always, if you have a Note 2, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxynote2root.com. And thanks guys for watching my video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and the subscribe button below here uh, to get more cool ROM reviews, tips, tricks, and more. And also check out video of the week over here if you haven't yet. And as always, uh, stay on Android.